Hey, yo, what's up, guys? Sade here with another episode of Six Experience. Today, I wanted to talk to you about Turkesterone. I've used this bottle of Turkesterone quite a bit. I've actually used a, a, quite a bit of bottles. And today, I wanted to talk about my experience with Turkesterone. Full disclaimer right before I start um, this is my experience with the product. Uh, you guys can go ahead and make of it what you will. I tried it. Um, I think I believe I've gone through five bottles. So, um, with that in mind, this is just my experience, guys. So first, let's start off with the dosage that I was taking. I believe the bottle recommends one capsule a day. Eric from moreplatesmoredates.com, he is the one that came out with the supplement line, with this specific supplement line, you know? So this supplement is from Gorilla Mind. Um, there's other people right now in the market selling Turkestrone, but this is the one I bought. And the dosage on this particular supplement is of one capsule but he explains on his video he, he gives a very prolonged explanation if you guys want to go ahead and check that out that is on his youtube channel you can guys are more than welcome to check that out he ends up saying that the dosage should be more about six capsules so i started off with four two in the morning and two in the afternoon and that's how i started for the first two weeks the first two weeks when i gave that a shot uh, i didn't notice much happening at all it was a total of four capsules throughout the day Granted, it wasn't taking the full dose that he was recommending. So when I finally bumped it up after those two weeks to six capsules, that's when I started noticing some changes. So what do you feel when you start taking Trichesterone? Uh, this was one of the biggest uh, things that I was thinking when I first started trying out Trichesterone. I was like, ooh, what is it gonna feel? Am I gonna feel like a little bit of a crackhead? Am I gonna feel like I have a bunch of energy? Am I gonna start jumping up the walls or something like that? No, nothing happens. <laughs> you start taking Trichesterone and literally crickets, guys. Crickets all day. There's there's nothing. I didn't feel anything at all at any point. There wasn't like a boost of any kind, you know? I'd probably get more from drinking one cup of coffee than I ever got from the entire bottle. So you don't feel an immediate effect or anything like that. When I was doing a, a dosage of four capsules, I didn't feel anything. And I was doing a, a dosage of six capsules, six, <laughs> six capsules. I will, it wasn't, it wasn't doing anything for me in that regards. However, I did start noticing it further down the line. So it's something I think that gets compounded over time and it's not something that you feel. So in that regards, it's good. It's not like if you take it at seven, uh, you know, you took the other half of the pills because you forgot midday or something like that, you know, like at 5 p.m. or or something, you know, seven o'clock that you're not going to go to sleep or you're not going to be able to sleep for whatever reason. You know, it's nothing like that. You just take them and you really don't feel anything and they I guess they start working over time don't know what's happening in our inside of our bodies but I did not feel anything if you guys did feel something please leave it down below L let me know what you guys felt down in the comment section because I haven't heard anything in this regard so there were a couple of uh, noticeable changes overall throughout the entire trial period that I that I gave Turkester on the trial so the one thing I did notice was that I started to slap on size size was coming a lot easier coming from a person that just I, I have a really easy time slapping on size if I start on um, making muscle if I start um, training for strength I start slapping on muscle quick but what I did see is that this muscle uh, looked it, it looked about the same you know everything everything felt about the same but you can tell that I was getting bigger and in a shorter amount of time and I started noticing in within two weeks you know so total this point four capsules um, first two weeks and then after that the next two weeks I would definitely notice some size that came along with using the turkestrum shortly after that month uh, that first month that had elapsed um, with four capsule dosage and then the six capsule dosage I kept on using it and I started noticing that my lips did start to go up um, not dramatically but I noticed that I started picking up 415 for deadlifts once again like I like I used to back in the day and so that came along fairly easy so I was a little bit surprised my clean and jerk got cleaner <laughs> and that only happens obviously throughout repetition and actually practicing it but the weights did feel a lot more comfortable at, at 
at the 225 range. Just starting that off felt a whole lot better. It felt like I practiced it uh, the amount of time that I've practiced it because sometimes you do practice a particular lift and even if you do practice it over and over you sometimes feel like it just you're there for a little while like you've plateaued. So maybe this um, helped me broke, break that plateau maybe not in like complete amount of weight but more in uh, the movement the ease of movement so I did notice that. Now on the cardio side a lot of people report that their cardio gets a lot better um, or that they feel that they they feel less fatigued and stuff I didn't personally see that however I do have a very good cardio and I'm not just saying that that's like the one thing I do take a lot of pride on and it, it is my cardio I, I I work very hard at it and plus I think I do very well in cardio situations more so than strength or more so than even any anything you know anything else I think cardio is my main thing and I really like doing it so I didn't notice much in that regards or in that area in comparison to maybe putting size and strength now as far as body fat I know a lot of people actually say that they start losing body fat um, while on terkesterone I did start seeing a little bit more definition in my muscles so maybe that could have been a factor of maybe me losing some body fat but uh, I don't think people should expect like you know massive amounts to be lost again uh, this is something that is barely being tested out and as a guinea pig myself I think it could potentially help though I wouldn't use terkestrone just for the purpose of uh, maybe losing weight I probably use it more along the lines of maybe starting to put on a little bit more muscle maybe doing it on a cleaner bulk that would be my 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 idea like I said maybe if, if I was just fully leaning out maybe that would have been a little better but because of the program that I had and when I was doing this definitely made me um, slap on more muscle and strength then maybe if I was just doing something like you know cleaning out but even then I believed it did serve as a little bit of a cut so yeah it, it might help some people out burning off some fat so fa some extra fat so yeah maybe a little bit of fat burned off there so 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 far good on the size good on the strength uh not so much in the cardio for me but i did see and and some maybe some um, body fat coming off not quite sure there and one of the biggest things that i think is is what a lot of people might be thinking is like hey do you keep the gains after you stop like if you stop using the product man like do you just like drop it you know you ran out of money and now you can't buy anymore and now you don't get to keep the gains i think you do keep the gains because um after the first month i gave it a week off and it was uh the first month and a half and i gave it a, a week off i felt the, exactly the same you know i was going to the gym i was still doing my routine i didn't feel like oh the turkesterone was helping or anything like that nor does it ever feel like when you take the product that you feel a boost throughout the day you know so i didn't i didn't feel that the product was gone even after I stopped taking it for a week and shortly after I started using it again I didn't even feel when I started putting it back in then after the second month that I that I tried it out once again I I, I saw that I kept everything that I've gained and everything that I've lost in, in potential weight so I did see that if you guys are in fear that maybe if you stop using it that you will maybe lose all the gains I don't think that's the case. I think you do keep everything that you've already worked for. So potentially give it a shot and see see if you guys find the same findings as I did. But once again, this is just me talking out of my experience. I gave this a, a very good shot. You know, it was it was two months, a little bit over the two months and a half. So it was almost three months of just uh, trying out the trichesterone, you know, and I felt pretty good and I still have quite a bit of a supplement left so I will be using it in the future maybe to bulk up a little bit more it is a little bit more on the expensive side once again I think it's worth giving it a shot especially if you're somebody that is up 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 there so what are my final thoughts on this so having said all these things I did try this out for a month and a half then I cut it off for a week then I got back on it once again and uh, again one a solid month again and what I did notice is that this trial period gave me a very good idea of that the product was doing the things that I just mentioned consistently it was doing them over and over again and so it wasn't like oh I think it's doing this just because of the first time no the second time around when when I gave it a shot for the second month uh, or month and a half when we got off and then the next month 
giving it a shot, I was able to notice that it was still the product that was doing the things that I just mentioned. I was, I was able to track this. One, uh, the product, it's pretty expensive. Uh, I try to buy it in bulk. Usually they have a little bit of a sale in Gorilla Mind every now and then, where it's like if you buy three bottles. So I went ahead and I bought six bottles and that's how I gave this a shot. And one bottle here, one bottle here. I've gone through at least five more. So I've given it quite a bit of a shot at this point, you know, and full doses, uh, dosages after, after the first time that I tried the fourth, uh, the four capsules, I noticed that that didn't work. So six dose, um, six capsules for me, um, uh, moving forward. If I am, if I'm ever going to use this product. So having said that it is expensive, it is, you are putting some, putting a good amount of your money into the product. However, if you're somebody that may be looking for size, this might just be a product that might be able to help you. Once again, this is my anecdote. There's not a lot of evidence supporting um, tricasterone other than word of mouth. So I would probably use it for if I was trying to put on size. It worked for me. And also if I was trying to put on strength, it looks like if you're at a very high, high level um, and you're maybe trying to break a plateau, I think it wouldn't hurt to give this a shot. You know, you might be one of those people that might just need that extra 1% and 1% might not do a lot for most people. But once again, if you're at the top, you know, if you're at that top, like two, 3% of people and you're trying to get that one extra percent, this might just be something that could potentially help you out, you know? But in any case, guys, thanks for joining me on another episode of Sage Experience. If you guys have had any similar experience with Turkestrone, I would love to hear about that. Please leave it down in the comment section. And as always, guys, comment if you liked it, subs if you loved it, and I will be seeing you guys on the next one. Zade out. Peace.